It seems we've been dealing in whispers and patent filings for years now, trying to figure out what the next iPhone will look like, but relax. The official iPhone invitation has landed, announcing an unveiling on September 12th, and for the first time, it'll be held at Apple's new Spaceship Campus in Cupertino at the Steve Jobs Theater. That is very appropriate, considering this is the 10th anniversary of the iPhone. Since new iPhones have been released like clockwork every year for the last six at Apple's fall event, we feel confident saying the 12th is when our new little iPhone 8 will arrive in the world, squalling and probably still lacking a headphone jack. No, I'm not over it. But it is likely to be radically different from its predecessors, as it's rumored to have an edge-to-edge -edge OLED screen, wireless charging, an updated dual camera system, a virtual home button, and perhaps face detection. One rumored feature is a rear-mounted Touch ID sensor. This video is still an unconfirmed test of the supposed new iPhone on a touch calibration station in a factory. We have been reading Apple's patents as well, which point to an under-the-screen biometric fingerprint sensor, possibly in this iPhone. Tipster Benjamin Guskin got his hands on a supposed iPhone 8, and you will see from the smooth appearance of the thing, it kinda looks like a Samsung Galaxy. Beyond a new iPhone, we will also likely hear about the HomePod voice-activated speaker designed to compete with the Amazon Alexas and Google Homes of the world. Apple's version was unveiled in June, but is not actually on the market yet. Apple has got to want to hit the holiday season for this though, so look out for pricing and a release date on that. Also due for updates, Apple TV and Apple Watch, as well as reconfigured iPhone 7S and 7S Plus. To get all caught up on the week's big news, go to Engadget.com and click the video tab.